Some poems get all the attention, some don't. <laughs> Several years ago, I wrote a series of poems called Damascus, uh, broken up into individual movements, and they described aspects of my relationship with my second wife, uh, starting from when we first really met until all the way into the relationship. This poem never got the um, credit it deserved. It's Damascus Movement 2. At the foot of the mountains I will drink from the dark spring, knowing the waters are not yet clear, but that if I do not show timely thirst, I may be cursed with eternal denial of the waters of life and precognitive memories. Such is the nature of capricious deities, such is the fate of earnest acolytes. The tainted honey of the womb of the gods is still sweeter than any fluid coursing through any lesser stone in the village. At the foot of the mountains I will drink from the dark spring, and then I will neither eat nor drink until my sight returns to me in keeping with the prophecies. A little footnote to this poem. Um, the city of Tucson, its name literally means at the foot of the mountain where the dark spring is. And this was written about our first romantic encounter, which occurred at night in Tucson. And uh, the next few days of my life were running in like 400 different directions emotionally. So, so if you if you hear this, Anne, yay. And if you don't, um, well, it's been a few years. I think that was 96, 97, something like that. Everybody stay safe. I'll be back in a day or two with more stuff. Stay out of trouble. Take care of yourselves. You all matter to somebody. All right? Love, peace, and poetry.